Hey, what's going on you guys? It is Carter here and today I'm back with some more Farming Simulator 15. Um, I didn't really think about doing it, I guess. Well, actually I did. I think I mentioned in the last video. Um, I'm here at field 16 and 17 and uh, I'm, not, I'm not completely sure what we grew in this field. Um, I think it's part of the mod. Uh, let me just look quick. Um, yeah, I'm not. Comp I want to say it might have been this Terry stuff. I'm not sure. I honestly don't know because it kind of looked like wheat, but it wasn't. It wasn't wheat. But yeah, so I, in that other field, it's soybean. Right there, that's soybean, and he's full. But I'm not gonna worry about him right now. Um, I rented a bunch of shit, and I kind of regret doing it because I lost a lot of money. Um, which is why I only have 19,000. If I had, if I wanted to, um, rented about everything, like the baler, um, that merger there, and then I was stupid and rented a bale wrapper, um, I'd be pr it's pretty set actually. I'd be doing pretty decent, and I don't know. I guess in a way it's good because I have all my bales, I'll have them for a while. I don't need to worry about baling for at least straw for a long time but at the same time it just sucks because I don't know why I decided to act so quickly and spend all my money right away um, so I figured once I get done with the soybean field I'm probably gonna sell the soybeans right away and then rent a mower and then start trying to mow so I can get some hay bales going and then I'm gonna buy I don't know what I said in the last video but I decided that I'm going to buy um, where was it? Uh, they had the prices of the animals somewhere. Was this it? No, that wasn't it. God damn. Oh, um, uh, they're the fattening cow. Um, I think I said last time I was going to buy either some pig or some beef, but I was looking at it, and uh, the fattening cow is just, it's so much better, like, as far as price goes. I mean, I could buy a lot of pigs for, like, the same price as, like, two fattening cows, but it would take a lot of pigs to equal the price of one fattening cow, so I think I'm going to buy a couple of the fattening cows, try to make a little bit of money, and then keep doing crops, and then eventually work into buying a lot more fattening cows and I think that's how I'm gonna do it I don't know yet but I think that sounds pretty decent all I can say is I'm happy that I have my uh, rent my rentable vehicles mod because if, if I didn't have that I would be screwed also in I guess the other new update news as far as oh there it goes as far as like my game goes, um, I do have some more options. I decided to buy Farming Simulator Gold Edition. I don't know why. I think I just had some money burning a hole in my pocket, so I bought gold. Um, I kind of regretted it, but now that I look at it, it's like it makes it. There's a lot more affordable stuff on here, especially combines like this. This is pretty good. That um, it's like twice the size of the Sampo, Sampo, whatever you want to call it, and it's only $80,000 more expensive, which is still quite a bit, but not that much when you think about it compared to like, I don't know, some other things. Um, so I'm trying to see, so this is actually a pretty good size combine. It's, it's bigger than this one. And it's actually almost the same size as this really big one as far as hopper capacity goes which is really impressive and then on top of that just the uh, processor here that's it's pretty good price compared to the crone so I definitely think I'll be investing in some of this Rostel mosh whatever you want to call it the Russian stuff I'll be investing in some of that um, other than that I don't think it added any other thing like anything really spectacular to the game um, I guess a small plow oh um, I think I might buy this too, because it's the same. It's cheaper 
than the Pottinger, but it's wider. So I think I might, but it's corn too. That's so that's a problem. I don't know. There's just, or I might just buy another one of these and hook it up to the back of another tractor. Um, I'm not quite sure what I want to do yet. The corn one I really tempted to buy just because it's it's a decent size, and I'm sure the header for corn isn't that too bad. Hopefully, eighteen thousand. I don't know. Who knows? We'll see what will happen. Um, but yeah. And I might start throwing in some of my mod stuff because I haven't really, besides like the bale wagon I rented and the, this merger that I rented, I haven't really used too many mods. And the reason I'm doing that is because um, it, some of the mods seem to conflict a little bit. Like, not like, uh, like crashing my game or anything, but like uh, kind of just lagging here and there. I don't really want to do that for a video. Come on now. So that's basically why I, I'm not really using too many mods. I mean, I have a lot of mods that I could be using right now that would be pretty useful to me. Um, but A, like I said, they kind of mess with the game a little bit, just lag here and there. And then on top of that, it's just some of the prices are a little bit unfair for some good mods that I have. And I would, as much as I'd love to get, like use the mod itself, the prices are like super unfair. Um, I'll give you an example in a second. Whatever, that'll be good enough. Um, just for tra reference to like tractors, uh, this is a really, really decent mod for as far as articulating tractors go. But it's only seventy thousand, which I, I guess, and maybe it is in real life. But I mean, for two hundred fifty horse, that's like a steal. And then there's like these ones, like. I just feel like a tractor of 250 horsepower or 215 horsepower shouldn't be 14,000. But then again, it is an old tractor. We have a tractor like this on our farm. It's from like the 80s, 70s, 80s. So I guess that's pretty understandable. Um, this is a beautiful tractor. I love this John Deere, the 7530. We have a 7510 on our farm, and I it's probably my favorite, one of my favorite tractors to drive. Um, and the Fent. The Fent is just gorgeous. And the Deutz. I mean, these these tractors. I these ones not so good. That's another reason why I'm not really doing them. But that tractor, and then the Fent of the Deutz. I will be purchasing those once I get big enough. But and then the Freightliner is by far my favorite semi, which is 157,000, which I felt like is it's enough. Um. But yeah, then like if I really wanted to go tiny and just get another quick combine to use, I could use that. Nah. Hmm. <laughs> Just trying to think about what I could do next, actually. And then I have giant TMRs. I don't know why I would need these ever, but I have them. And they're massive. This thing is huge. Just to give you like a reference to how big this thing is, 42,000, that's that's the mod, big mod one. And the biggest one in the vanilla game is that's what is this 12,000 and 18,000 so <laughs> it's pretty ridiculous um, but I think what I am gonna no 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 why why did you do that Carter Fuck, now I have six hundred twenty six dollars okay now I really need to hammer hard but I think <laughs> I can't believe I just... What did I just do? Why did I double click? Oh. But I will be buying this next. Probably as far as feeding goes. Um, I don't think I need a large one just because I'm doing, you know, just the... God damn it. I'm really actually very angry with myself right now. Wow. What was I thinking? Like, what was going through my head? <laughs> That was so dumb. That's probably one of the dumbest things I've ever done. I mean, I've probably mispurchased something maybe like four times in the whole time I've played Farming Simulator 15. And of course, the fourth time, fourth or fifth time, it's on camera. Or not on camera, but on recording. But what was I thinking? How dumb can I be? Ah, uh, we might as well put our 
put it to good use, test it out. I've never actually used that thing because it's kind of worthless. You can just throw it in TMR and it does the same thing. Fuck. I'm actually really mad about that. That was so dumb. That was just ridiculously stupid. Um, I don't know. I should probably go pick up that combine full of soybeans now because I really need to start cracking down on that because I of this brilliant goddamn purchase I made. God, I feel so dumb. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, I actually don't know how to use this. So we're going to figure out how to use this. Open the door. Make his deal, deal. No? Okay. Um, yeah, I've never used this thing before. It's honestly kind of a mystery as to far, how do you use this. Do you back up to it? Does it like automatically load or do I need to use like a bail loader? Or? I assume you need to back up. I feel kind of dumb that I haven't used this before though. Does it auto load? No, it doesn't. What? I don't. I guess I don't get how to use this thing, and I don't really want to know. So I might just resell because <laughs> this is just dumb. Why do I do stuff like this to myself? I wasn't trying to pick it up, but I guess we can. I guess we can pick it up. Try to drop it on or something like that. Will this actually work? No. Wow, that actually worked. Holy shit. That's pretty cool. Okay, this is pretty impressive now. I'm, let's uh, let's find the fattening cow thing. And then we'll finish the video right after this. I want to say that might be it. Sheep. Beefs. Pigs. Yeah, so it's, it's the cow one. Let's give her a rip. Does it do it automatically or like what, what does it do here? Oh, unload. Straw isn't accepted. <laughs> oh, here we go. Here we go. That's that's it. It Jesus. Wow, that's we should just go Maybe, I don't know, that was ridiculous. Okay, well, nevertheless, I just unhooked. Um, I think I'm going to the video here, you guys. At least I know that thing works, like I've never used it before, but I hope you guys enjoy this video. I apologize I didn't get much done, but, um, hmm, I've never really looked into this either. But yeah, um, leave a suggestion as to what you think I should do next, like if I should you know like try to uh, get into the oh please tell me I just get stuck um but yeah leave a comment down below saying what you think I should do if I should get into um like the uh get into animals right away or if I should try to uh do a lot more crop farming and then get into animals or if I should I don't know. Just leave a comment in, section, in the comment section down below. Um, hit that like button. Uh, visit my Twitter and my website. Also linked in the description down below. And if you want to, visit my Patreon. Um, I don't really do much with that, but you can if you want. It's also in the link. Or, or in this, in the, has a link in the description down below. Jesus Christ. Um, and as always, guys, this was Carter. Peace out.